Kakamega County's Ozimiu leadership has criticized IBC chairman of Fula Chebukati for suspending Kakamega gubernatorial elections for the second time, saying that was a scheme to rig the polls. The ODM deputy party leader weekly for Paranya also says the coalition is confident of a win at the Supreme Court as it seeks to overturn the presidential election result. <laughs> Two days to what would have been the date for the governor's election in Kakamega and Mombasa, and the Kakamega gubernatorial candidate from Azimio is adamant that the elections must go on. The elections were postponed for the second time in one month due to what the RABC termed as harassment and intimidation of its staff. The Azimio team in Kakamega wants the elections held according to the earlier schedule. Don't test our patients. Tunataka uchaguzi wa ugavana kakamega ifanywe haraka. Election! Election Act inasema uchaguzi lazima ifanyike na katiba. Every second Tuesday of August every after five years. <laughs> Kamega's Azimio team moved to court seeking that IABC be compelled to conduct the elections on Tuesday. The team faulted the IABC chairman for mishandling the Kakamega gubernatorial elections, accusing the IABC chair of foul play. IABC is expected to hold a meeting with candidates from Kakamega and Mombasa on Monday. At the national level, the commission is also getting ready to file a petition at the Supreme Court challenging the presidential election result. Oparanya says the Azimio team has collected enough evidence to convince the Apex Court that the victory was stolen at the Tarling Center. Na pia kule juu, wakati sisi tulikuwa tunatafuta kura, wengi walikuwa kazi yao nukupanga vile wataiba kura. Na nimesikia yale imefanyika. Kwa hivyo kesho vile mmeambiwa tunaenda kotini. Mimi nitakuwa kule kesho kusindikiza wale wanaenda kotini. Kuona ya kwamba haki inafanyika. Na tunafanya tumefanya hesabu tumepata tulipata kura milioni moja saidi kulingana na sile ambazo sile tolewa. The leaders were in Navaholo sub county attending the burial of engineer Jared Waudo Wangia and his wife, Dr. Christine Wangia. Brenda Wanga, Citizen TV, Nairobi.